New on Wake Up, we ask you this week to take a walk around your home. Do you have some things you don't need? Well, you can donate them to help the homeless and less fortunate in our area. News Force Katie Alexander is live this morning at Life Storage in Chictawaga with more on the Stock the Storage Unit campaign. Good morning. Good morning, Jordan. We're standing inside the storage unit that was donated by Life Storage for this year's donation drive. And you can see there are some items here, but there's a lot more space in here for more items to be donated. This is Melissa. She is the organizer of this third year for this drive. How's it been going? Going good so far. I hope to get a lot more donations so we can help a lot of our less fortunate community members. And you're collecting items all the way through the end of April, correct? Yes. yes. And what's going to happen with them? So then they will go to individuals and families in need in our community. I am partnering with several local organizations to help identify those folks and get these donations to them. And all of this is done in memory of your nephew. Tell me about him. So my nephew Danny passed away in 2014, but prior to his passing, he was helping the homeless in his community and a lot of individuals that were facing similar struggles like he was. And up until the day he passed, he was helping others. So I just wanted to carry on that legacy. And what's that been like for you? I mean, this is now the third year does it help with your process of grieving? It sure does. I, you know, I had to find a way to keep his positive memory alive, and I knew right away what I wanted to do, and it has helped with the grief process. And I hope that he's he's watching and and um, and proud of what this, the community is doing in his honor. Certainly, I'm sure he is. And for everybody who's watching right now, what's your message about what is needed? Um, personal care items, household items, gently used furniture, uh, any of those items that individuals and families can use um, that may be starting over into a new home. And you can find the full wish list on our website, wivb.com. Go to the Founded on Four section. You can also find Melissa's phone number and email address there so you can get in contact with her to drop off a donation. Again, they're being collected all the way through the end of April. For now, reporting live, Katie Alexander, News 4. All right, Katie, thank you.